In this video, we're going to be solving a problem that asks us to calculate the flow rate in a circular or round pipe. The question reads, water is flowing through a circular pipe. The pipe is 16 inches in diameter. The velocity of the flow is five feet per second. Calculate the flow rate and report the results in gallons per minute. Before we get started, let's talk for a minute about the physical problem that we are solving. Here is a cross section of the pipe with the dimensions labeled. We can see here that the diameter of the pipe is 16 inches. We can also see from the side view that the velocity of the flow is five feet per second. This is a real type application and could be either a pipe or a circular channel that is flowing completely full. All flow rate type problems like this one utilize the same formula for calculating flow rate. The formula is Q which is the symbol for flow rate, is equal to the velocity of the flow multiplied by the cross-sectional area of the pipe. In this case, it is a circular or round pipe. You will also need the formula for the area of the shape of the pipe. Here we have the formula for the area of a circle, which is 0.25 multiplied by pi, which is approximately 3.14, multiplied by the diameter of the pipe, and multiplied a second time by the diameter of the pipe. The very first step we want to take in solving the problem is to list out all of the knowns and unknowns given in the problem statement. For this problem, we have been given that the diameter of the pipe is 16 inches and the velocity of the flow is five feet per second. The unknown is the flow rate. Let's pause for a second and talk about units. In this problem, the known values have been given to us in a mixture of units. The diameter is in inches and the velocity is in feet or feet per second. All the known values must be in a common unit of measure like feet before you can use the flow rate formula. Since we have been given values with different units, we will need to convert to common units before we can perform the calculation. The conversion is straightforward and here, we have converted the diameter from 16 inches to 1.33 feet. We are now ready to calculate the answer. The flow rate is equal to the velocity multiplied by the cross-sectional area. The area of a circle is given by 0.25 multiplied by pi, or 3.14, multiplied by the diameter, and multiplied by the diameter again. The resulting calculation is the velocity multiplied by 0.25 multiplied by pi or 3.14 multiplied by the diameter of the pipe and multiplied by the diameter of the pipe one more time. Therefore, the flow rate is equal to 5 feet per second times 0.25 times 3.14 times 1.33 feet times 1.33 feet which is 6.95 cubic feet per second. The last step to complete the problem is to convert the result that we have from cubic feet per second to gallons per minute. You can accomplish this by taking the result we just calculated, 6.95 cubic feet per second, and multiplying it by 60 seconds per minute, and further multiplying it by 7.48 gallons per cubic foot. The units of seconds will cancel out, the units of cubic feet will cancel out, and the final result is in gallons per minute. The final result for this problem is that the flow rate through the circular pipe is 3,117.6 gallons per minute. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions or feedback, please comment below. If you found this video helpful, please like it and consider subscribing to the channel so that you get access to all future videos.